Good morning, volunteers. I'm Salali. And I'm Nathan, and welcome back to this week's episode of Lee TV. Hey, Nathan, would you want to be rich? A million dollars rich? Ashley wants to know, what, what would, would you, you do, do with, with a million dollars? dollars? What would you do with a million dollars? I like to upgrade my suit better. First off, I would pay my tides. You got to pay your tides. And the second thing, I would build a, a school for students who go through different situations and may have to leave home for a while and then go back to finish school. So I would say, you get an education, and you get an education, and you get an education. Yo iría a Nueva York con mi familia en Año Nuevo. Ask Lee wants to know, what would you do with a million dollars? Good question. I think I would save it all and never spend it so I could consistently flex on all of my friends that I was a millionaire. I've always wanted to do that and I think that's how I would use my million dollars. I'd probably save half of it and then go on a very expensive trip with my family and friends and then save up the rest for my future family and donate to charity. So, Student Council presents Prom 2019. The theme is Happily Ever After and will be held at the Red Oak Ballroom on April 13th from 7 p.m to 11 p.m. Hi, I'd like to buy a prom ticket for my off-campus guests. Do you have your off-campus guest request form? Yes. That would be $45. Tickets for off-campus guests will require a off-campus guest form signed by admin. Tickets will be 45 pre-sale and 50 at the door. There will be no refunds for lost and stolen tickets. Remember to bring your ID and invitation when you arrive to prom. Student Council presents Powder Puff April 25th at Kamalander Stadium from 6 to 8 p.m. Hope to see you there. Booktology has reached its final four books. This is the last week to vote for your favorite book. On Thursday, the final voting begins, and by Friday, we should have a winner. Hi guys, I'm Denise from the I Am Second Group. Um, this week we'll be meeting Thursday after school in room M201. I hope to see you guys there and learn what it means to be second. Attention seniors, here are the procedures to follow when submitting college acceptance and scholarship award letters. One, students must turn in a paper copy of the acceptance and or award letters. Two, email pictures will not be accepted. Three, all students must turn them into Mrs. Annalisa Trevino in the Career Center. Deadline to submit college acceptance and or award letters is Thursday, April 25th. Attention all students, if you are interested in attending summer school, registration information will be forthcoming in mid-April. Summer school will be held at Madison High School. Congratulations to Brandon White for placing second in the computer applications event at District UIL Academic Meet this past Saturday. Brandon will go on to compete at the regional event in computer applications. Good luck, Brandon. Attention future Business Leaders of America members. We will be having a member meeting this week, Thursday, April 4th, in room CT207. See Remind for more details. Mark your calendar. FBLA will be conducting new officer elections for the 2019-2020 to 2020 school year on April 25th. Attend this week's meeting on Thursday for more information if you are interested in becoming an officer next year.
This week's trivia question, what is April's birth flower? A. Carnations B. Sunflowers C. Poppy D. Daisies Volunteers, I'm Miss Trevino, and on this week's college checklist, we're covering something pretty cool because I reminded you guys last week that we're having an upcoming college fair. So for all of you who are having questions about general college stuff, so where can I eat when I go to a college campus, what are dorms like, what is financial aid, what even is college? What do you do there? We're having the college fair this coming Thursday on April 4th. It's gonna be outside in the cafeteria courtyard. So please, please, please make sure you stop by. We're gonna have tons of representatives from colleges all around Texas and even from a couple of out of state schools. So I know Texas Tech is coming, UT Austin, St. Mary's, uh, Texas State. So please be sure to come out, stop by in the cafeteria courtyard this Thursday to visit with different college representatives and learn a lot more about all the potential and things that you have to do in college for the next four years. So I hope to see you at the fair volunteers. Have a great day. See you next week. Cuando te llame, si hubieras amado, cuando te amé, serías en mis sueños la mejor mujer, si no supiste amar, ahora te puedes marchar. <risa> No me acuerdo, dije 
cuando te amé. Y no supiste amar. Ahora te puedes marchar. Correct answer is D. Daisies. Daisies start blooming in spring throughout early summer in Texas. Thank you for watching this week's episode of Lee TV. Make sure to come out and support your boys' soccer team tonight. And remember to tune in next week. And remember, there's, there's nothing, nothing stronger, stronger than, than the heart of a volunteer. volunteer.